Hey guys, so yesterday I was working on this Redux Toolkit code and I was creating some API slices. The interesting thing that I noted here is that whatever key I add here is actually present inside this tree structured code. For example, used to do queries present here. Now, even if I change this, TypeScript auto inferences it and it says that this is wrong. It's not present, it's never declared. And then I have to add the correct value here. So how is TypeScript doing it? So let's take a look at this particular piece of code. I've created a function called bar, which takes an argument called arg and returns that argument as is. Now, if I simply do red val dot, I do not cut any suggestions. What I need here is that since I'm returning the same object as it is, I want abc as suggestions, which I'm not getting here. There is a very fine and simple workaround to it. So just make this function as generic. Now, if I simply add dot here, I get these suggestions, A, B, C. So we are almost halfway there. We are getting the correct suggestions, the dynamic suggestions of the object literal that we have passed down here. The only thing here is to create our own dynamic functions and then we can change its type. So let's create our own dynamic functions here. What we essentially need here is that for every key present inside this object literal, we need to return an object that has function that is get plus key in uppercase, which means that the object should have get A, get B, get C as functions. If the key is of multiple characters, let's say X, Y, Z, it should return get X, Y, Z. So let's create the dynamic functions here. I'll extract the OBJ here. And then I'll extract the keys as well. I'll just iterate over the keys. And then for each key, I'll simply create a new function and add it to the object. So I'll do, uh, I'll also create a dummy object before, like just let's say getters as an empty object. And then I'll simply add those keys. So get and then k dot uppercase. and then a function that returns obj k and return getters. Now, if we run this particular code, let's try to run this. We see we have these particular properties here with the associated functions attached. But if I do a suggestion here, I do not get any from TypeScript. Now, how to do that? we have to return the correct type. So let's create a type here. So we'll simply create type uppercase key object or rather record. And it'll just be of type record. Let's say any and any. And I'll add this particular key as a return type to the function called bar. And you see still, we don't have any suggestions available here because we haven't used this type T here. Let's just pass this type T to the type that we just declared. And then in inside the key of the record, what I'll do is that the type of the key of the record should be key of T. Now what does this do is that it will start giving me suggestions for A, B, and C because what it's doing is that whatever keys that are present inside the object that we have passed of this type T, it'll just use that type as the key of this particular record. Now, we can use the power of template literals of TypeScript. Now, what does template literals do? So, if I remove this key of T here and add in simply a string here, the suggestions would give me exactly the string that I just entered. 
and then if I do something like get and then add a dynamic entry here using sing string interpolation what I'll add here is the exact thing that I'd added in the beginning key of t now it gives it's giving me an error because actually the key of a record can be string number or symbol but since we are sure that it's of type string we can add an intersection operator to string here it's kind of type casting this particular type into string now if we go down and see the suggestions we get the correct suggestions but still they are a bit incorrect because a b and c are still lower cased what we have done here is that all the keys are upper cased what we can leverage here is the uppercase type of TypeScript and we can pass in the value key of t intersection string into this uppercase operator of TypeScript and now if I add dot here I get the correct suggestions okay now if we try to use multi-character values what it does is that it actually uppercases every character it doesn't look good right for example if I just replace AST with first name here and I'll just start John here this first name it doesn't look good right we should capitalize it so we can simply use some uh, JavaScript here so uh, let's say const uh, C it can be K dot we'll just use substring and it can be 0 and 1 and then dot 2 uppercase and similarly the rest of the string can be 1 and that can be as it is so let's just concatenate it C and then R so we did this and instead of uppercase we can simply use capitalize here and now if I see the suggestions we get the correct suggestions and it looks nice let's just try to call this and see if it works or not uh, it works and it gives us the correct value hey guys so that's it from this video I hope you liked it and it might serve you some purpose please leave a like or subscribe to this channel and please add a comment as well if you want to suggest me something it will be of great help thank you see you in the next video